This is Jeremy from Earth Groans, and you're watching Soundlink TV. Alright, what is up everybody? This is Trent with Soundlink TV here with Jeremy from Earth Groans. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> How you doing, man? Doing good. Awesome. You're on this tour with War of Ages. Yes. <laughs> we had yep. to mess that up a couple of times on Convictions. Yep. And how's that? How's this tour been treating you guys? I've seen on social media it's been going pretty well in some, yeah. and in some places. Yeah, I'd say this tour has probably been our best to date, actually. It's okay. been incredible. Um, it's nice, too, because we've been on, like, the south and east uh, where it's a little bit warmer, the climate. Yeah. Uh, back home in like South Dakota, it's like super cold, below 20, tons of snow. So it's nice to be like today. It's like it was like straight up like hoodie weather or yeah. even t-shirt weather. Um, but besides that, the shows have been incredible. Uh, um, great turnouts, great response from the crowds. Um, not to mention that Conviction the War of Ages are two of the raddest bands around. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah. So all, all around, I got nothing to say but good things about this tour. Honestly, oh, sweet. So you say you're from South Dakota. Yep. And I know your label mates, the ongoing concept, are from like around there too, uh, uh, Montana I, or some Idaho, yeah, something not, like that. They're from up yeah, there. they're up there, kind so, of middle of nowhere too. <laughs> so you so guys are like, boonies, yep. yeah, coming out of here, uh, like a, a state that's not really known for its music scene, <laughs> yep. you know, producing, you know, yeah, there's, you know, heavy bands, and so. What was it like trying to get your footing there? I guess I guess probably being one of the only ones there, and let alone sure. getting signed to Solid State. Yeah, um, I think with <laughs> that moped, <laughs> sound like a mosquito. Um, what was I saying? South uh, Dakota. Yeah, South yeah. Dakota. You know, with with the internet um, and like a van and trailer, it's a, it's really not that hard. I mean, anybody can do it from anywhere. Uh, one nice thing about South Dakota, it, it is super cheap to live there. So, you know, cost of living, like, while we're on tour isn't incredibly, um, you know, easy to manage. Um, but, uh, I mean, and, and it's cool because there, there is a good metal scene back home. Uh, you know, we don't hear much about it because it's just one of those, like, sea markets that never yeah. gets hit for yeah. tours. But there are people there that want it. So we have a huge support system behind us. That's so, awesome. You know, it's not as hard as, as people uh, make it out to be. Okay. Um, yeah, like, yeah, I mean, we've been touring since day one. And we do tour outside of the Midwest quite a bit. Um, but uh, you know, it, it we have a great support system there, and yeah, all around I got I got nothing bad to say about South Dakota being from there. Okay. You know? So yeah, we made it work. You just when you like when you want to do something, you you feel like you have a calling on your life. You do whatever you have to do to make it happen. Yeah. You know? Okay. So. Yeah, before this, we were talking about both of our love for Under Oath and everything. And so mm -hmm. you guys are on Solid State, you know, yep. which is home to them for many, many years. So, right. you know, I guess, you know, being a fan of bands on that label, you know, yep. along with like Norma Jean and Cherry, you know, yes. whichever one you like, you know, yep. getting get, getting that offer or getting signed to a label with that kind of history, you yep. know, like what was, what were you guys, uh, what was your guys' reaction to that? And how's that oh, experience dude. been? Dude, it's been incredible. Absolutely incredible. I mean, like all of those bands legitimately like are my favorite band. Um, ever since I was young, like all of us, I can say that for all these guys that are standing back here <laughs> being super awkward. They can hop in if they um, want to. <laughs> um, they've, they, you know, we, we all like dreamed of being on Solid State. And we used to joke about it all the time, like in the van, like, yeah, when we're on Solid, on Solid State, not actually thinking that yeah. would be, you know, a legitimate dream. Um, but yeah, it was totally a dream come true. We were on tour actually the day that we got the email. And we were all just chatting, and I was just like, everybody, everybody shut up and listen to me right now. And I read the email, you know, that they, they, were, they were interested in. And, uh, and just working with them, I mean, they're, they're a really great crew. They're all really, really awesome dudes. Um, they're a bunch of idiots like us, like as far as just joking yeah. and, you know, having a good time and stuff. So uh, they fit in really well with us. And, um, yeah, I don't, I don't know. It, uh, it couldn't. It couldn't be any better than it is. Yeah. Yeah. The interesting yep. about Solid State is like, I mean, they have a lot of bands making a name for themselves right now, so they're yep. still like getting that new, I guess, yeah. crop up there. So like, really, you know, it's like Fit for King, Silent Planet carrying mm -hmm. that torch, you know. So, um, what, what's that experience like getting be able to be, I guess, like one of probably working hard to be one of those bands that probably come up to be one of those mm -hmm. classic Solid State bands of the future? Like, or is is that in your head a little bit? Yeah, definitely. I mean, we're tiny. We're totally like the tiny, like little fish in the huge pond. Yeah. You know, and right now we're in this weird like limbo of like 
well, we're not just like a local band anymore, but we're also not a big band. So yeah. we're like just trying to like snag like support slots and stuff like that. You know, the, the dream is like, or the ideal situation is to get on, you know, some of those bigger tours, like spot one of four or whatever we can do to yeah. be support for some of these bigger bands. But, you know, we're just kind of taking our time and we're, we're not in a rush. You know, we have, um, we're, we're coming out with a new record right now. So we're like, you know, kind of working on getting that done. So we're not in a super huge rush to get on to some of those bigger tours but of course we're going to accept any of those tours that we can okay. you know as they come our way um so it's it's a slow grind um a slow build a steady grind okay. but you know yeah when can people expect that new record you guys put on ep not too long ago too, yeah and so, so you guys are writing this one is there any more experimentation going on or is it kind of like building off the sound there are you guys sure. shifting it a little bit sure i'll try and uh answer all that um, <laughs> oh, one. Sorry. no you're good so I, I guess in what we were talking about earlier is it more so like they're only chasing safety to define the great line, <laughs> or is it defined to lessen the sound? <laughs> well, um, <laughs> to make it easier. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's it's a very similar it's a very similar sound. It's maybe a little heavier. We definitely like our it's a more mature sound. Okay. You know, we as we've been playing these songs. So actually, the album we have out now, uh, Renovate, we actually dropped that like two years ago. And then we did a re-release okay, when we yeah, signed with yeah. Solid State just to get one more big push on it. Yeah. So then we toured on it one more year. And now uh, we're going to come out with an EP uh, in June or July-ish. Okay. You know, that's TBA, of course. Um, but as soon as we get home from this record, we're actually going to be jumping in the studio uh, to get that done. Um, but, yeah, I would just say it's it's a very similar, just aggressive, metal, kind of chaotic, off-timey you know just heavy but with a little bit more mature sound i guess yeah. you know as we've been playing this record and you know we're we're learning our our style more and more because that is our very first record so yeah we're still you know still like learning what we are as a band and everything okay. so sweet so yeah. you gotta get you mentioned going to the studio after this writing some yep. new music any other stuff you can talk about? Any news before we wrap it up? Um, no, not. A I mean, that's the main thing. We're we're gonna be doing a lot of cool uh, festivals this year. Sweet. Um, yeah, I don't think a lot of them are announced yet, so I don't want to like talk about them too much. Does except Joshua get... Fest. Joshua okay. Fest. That's out in California. Does um, one get announced on March first, and it might be happen to be the last one to happen? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but. Uh, yeah, so there's there's a lot of cool festivals and a lot of cool tours that we're going to be a part of, but nothing that I can really talk about yet because yeah. you know how the music biz yeah, is. Everything yeah. can change, and you don't want to give any, any spoilers away. But, yeah, I guess the, the new record is the main thing that, you know, we're, we're grinding hard on right okay. now. Okay, so. sweet. All right, man. Yeah, well, thanks it. for your time today. Dude, absolutely. Everybody check out Earth Groans. They're freaking killer. And I'm Trent uh, with Sound Lake TV. Thanks for watching. Yeah. I'm a to a friend of victory